We'll go to the college hardwood now. UTEP has a quick turnaround this week after its first win of the season and their first win over rival New Mexico State since 2019 on Saturday night. The Miners will host D3 opponent Sewell Ross on Tuesday at 7 p.m. This is a great chance for UTEP to continue building some chemistry with so many new players. Head coach Joe Golding loves the depth on this year's team. They played 11 guys in each of their first two games, and all 11 of them scored Saturday versus the Aggies. If we're going to play this many guys, we got to continue to get out in pass lanes and continue to disrupt stuff and turn them over. You know, uh, we got to continue to buy into that. It's going to be our team, I think, a little bit. We played 11 guys tonight, which I'm excited about. The good thing with depth and competition is if you don't show up ready to play, somebody else will be ready to play. That depth allows UTEP to play as hard as Golding wants them to defensively. They will host Suros tomorrow, which has five El Pasoans on the roster. Julian Paredes, Christian Nevadas, Mitch Martinez, Omar Ibarra, and Manny Flores, who we just mentioned. It's a 7 p.m. tip tomorrow night.